Right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do the perfect silver mirror. So we're gonna start with the test tube, and then we're gonna scale it up and do it in this round bottom flask. So the first thing you need is five cubic centimeters of 0.1 mole per decimeter cubed silver nitrate solution. So I've already measured that out. So that goes into your test tube. We're then gonna add some concentrated ammonia solution and we're just going to add it a drop at a time so after the first drop you get this brown precipitate so i'm just going to keep adding the concentrated ammonia until that brown precipitate goes it's really important to not add too much of this so you can see hopefully that that's gone now Next thing I'm doing is adding a spatula of glucose powder. I'm just gonna let that dissolve in the test tube. The final thing, we need a source of heat, so I've just boiled this kettle. So we'll half fill the beaker with boiling water. And then we'll just put the test tube into the boiling water and swirl. And hopefully, we'll have a perfect silver mirror. Like that. That's brilliant, that. Yeah, it is. I love it. That's great. Okay, so time for the flask. So I've got 100 centimetres cubed of silver nitrate in there, so I'm scaling it up 20 fold. So 100 cm cubed of silver nitrate, I'm going to start adding the conch ammonia. So we're getting that brown precipitate. So we'll keep adding this until that brown precipitate goes. So you can see the precipitate's gone now. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put this into the boiling water, the beaker of boiling water, and get this warm so that when we put the glucose in, I can just swirl it out of the, the hot water and hopefully we'll see the silver coating appear on, on the flask. So the flask's been in the water for a few minutes now, so I've got 20 spatulas of the glucose powder in the beaker, so I'm just gonna pour this in via the funnel. Hopefully, ah, I can see myself, it's obviously working. Well chuffed with that. One last thing we must say is that the contents of the flask needs to be disposed of very quickly because it's potentially explosive. Silver fulminate could form. So I'm gonna get rid of that now. <laughs> 